Hello friends, welcome back to another video tutorial in SketchUp 2021 for beginners. I am architect Sonu Rai from Glad Studio and in this today video tutorial, I am going to discuss with you push pull tool in SketchUp. So you can see your toolbar set here and you can see this symbol. This is for push and pull. So it is face entities to sculpt 3D models. So basically it is used to extrude your 2D objects into 3D objects. So it is very, very hand handy in SketchUp. So if you want to extrude this rectangle which is in 2D shape, so you can go to your push pull tool here or you can directly type P on your keyboard and push pull tool will be appeared. So now I am going to extrude this. So you are required to bring your tool here inside your model and you can see this dot dot like this. That means you are ready to extrude your object and you can see on the bottom of this that it is asking to click to select the face that you want to push or pull and you can also enter distance here so i am going to click this once and now i am going to move it upward so that can extrude it so whatever distance you can extrude it so i am going to enter here any value so suppose i am going to enter 10 feet here so you can see this face is extruded that 2d shapes you can also select any of this face and you can extrude it left side you can extrude to whatever direction so suppose i want to extrude it and i'm going to enter any value here 12 feet so you can see this is 12 feet so i'll go control that and now similarly uh, i can extrude this and I can select this tool here and you can bring your uh, tool here inside your 2D shapes and then you are try to select this dot dot like things and then extrude it so you can extrude it easily and there are also various methods so suppose I want to extrude this to this height I can simply bring this push pull tool here and now I will not enter any value here. I will simply bring my or uh, this tool and I will move to this height and I will click once on this edge. And you can see this height is similar to this height. So likewise, I, I can also select this first. So I'm going to select this 2D shape first here, this hexagon. And now I will enter P on my keyboard and I can extrude it from anywhere it's it need not uh, to be in, inside of this 2d shapes so i'm going to extrude it from outside and you can see if you select it from initial you can extrude it without going to uh, inside of this object so that you can extrude it so i'm going to enter any value at 12 feet so likewise you can extrude it and it is also used to cut this object in this extrude command can also use to pull this inside so if you want to create suppose if you want to create a door here you can simply go to this rectangle tool and you can draw a door here so i am going to simply create a line tool here and now i am going to select this push pull and i will select this face here and i will drag this inward and I will select it once. Now you can see the door like thing is cut into this object. So likewise you can use this push pull tool you know 3D modeling. So you will understand in detail when you will start creating building models. So this was the tutorial for the today session. The next session I will come with some more interesting topics in a SketchUp. Bye bye.